Today's video is on the 2020 Adventure 89RB. First thing you notice on the 2020 Adventure 89RB is the two tone exterior, the gray exterior nose, and the white side panel with the new graphics for 2020. As we come down the side panel, you see the dual propane compartment with two 20 pound propane bottles and an auto switch over valve. Behind that on the driver's side is the dual battery compartment where your dual 27 group batteries can fit into here and also is your wiring for your generator and your 12 volt battery disconnect all located in this compartment. Notice the magnetic catches for all exterior baggage doors. Hold them up out of the way. Easy access for your storage doors. Just above the battery compartment is your 30 amp power cord connection. To the rear of that is your service center which houses your city water connection, your black tank flush connection, your potable water fill, and your outside shower. As we go down the passenger side of the unit, again you see the new graphics. At the front of the camper is your service access for your refrigerator and below that for your furnace, ducted heat throughout. This is your hot water heater service panel. You notice the large windows that are all thermal pane windows throughout. As we come around to the rear of the unit, you see the gray exterior rear wall and the black accent accessories like the fat ladder, the electric 12 volt awning, and the new black powder coated non skid comfort step bumper. That's an option for this model. One of the nice features of the 89RB is that you can fit a short bed or long bed truck and still have generator capable. This has the optional generator built on board. Just pull up the swing away ladder, it latches out of the way, open your door to your generator compartment and have full access to your Onan Cummins 2500 LP generator. Next let's take a look underneath the bonus step of the new Comfort Step bumper and take a look at the basement, new slide storage tray and your dump bed. Just remove that bonus step and you can see the basement door here you simply just open up and down below here is your full basement, your dump valves, gray and black controls. And to the right side is the new for 2020, the ball bearing storage tray. You can see with the Comfort Step bumper, the easy two steps, Comfort Step bumper and bonus step, gives you easy four step entry into the camper. Let's go and take a look at the inside of the 89RB. First thing you notice as you walk in is the new flooring and the all new interiors for 2020. Large window over the dinette. This is the dream dinette. No table leg underneath. You can see the new flooring for 2020 under the dinette eliminating the carpet from the past models. You see above large overhead cabinet storage and the dinette makes into a bed which we'll show here shortly. All you do is you flip that lever underneath, press down the table, pull the back cushions into place to make into a dinette bed. As you can see here it'll make into a full length dinette bed. Now there is an adjustment on this bed if you want to extend it out so that it's full width front and rear. You can just pull this slider out and use the filler cushion to make it line up. As you can see here, it gives you that full length bed by using that extension. You can use this bed with or without the extension, the additional cushion. All the windows come with a pleated shade which blocks out your sun. As you can see here as we lift that, you can see the additional sun that's shining in. Notice the large window looking out to your campground. And up above you see your overhead cabinets, your stereo in the middle, 
The stereo is an AM, FM, CD, DVD, player, Bluetooth, and app controllable by an app from your phone. Up above you have the overhead cabinets with nice deep storage throughout and that's located on both sides of your stereo section. There's a place to store the added cushion if you want to store it there and then your speakers are in this section too. You also have two speakers outside for your outside stereo enjoyment. As we move forward to the dinette you see the 110 outlet and your thermostat control on the front wall of the dinette. As we move around to the, you see the front of the camper, you see the bedroom queen for your galley. This is a seven cubic foot refrigerator. It's got the designer accent panels for 2020. It matches the rest of the interior design. Nice large freezer. Remember this is seven cubic foot. Most other manufacturers are using six or smaller. As we move forward into the bedroom suite, this has a 60 by 80 queen mattress. This is the new double density designer mattress. Double door wardrobe to the passenger side or the right side. And through the whole bedroom area you can see the back side of the TV in the mounted position. This has the optional TV in this model and the side window and your large full-length cabinet. Nice style of this cabinet. It's the thermal form countertop design like the countertops and it gives you long deep storage full length of your bedroom area. You notice on the ceiling is the standard Haynes moonroof new for 2020 for adventure. As we move up to the front on the passenger side is a nightstand with additional storage under the nightstand. Notice up front also the two reading lights. These are all new lights for 2020 for adventure. These give you individual controls. It's the push button LED surface mount light. It gives you individual control throughout the camper. To the right side or the passenger side is the double door mirrored wardrobe. The dual sliding mirrored doors can slide from either side. You can see the large drop down storage in the wardrobe below. Then up above is your hanging rod for a close full length hanging all the way throughout this closet. Here is another close up view of the passenger side nightstand and that storage underneath we were talking about. It's kind of a hidden storage. It's a place in the front where you can store magazines, maps, etc. And then it also comes with your dual USB and 12 volt charge station and your 110 outlet for needed power in the bedroom. The Haynes Moonroof comes with the fabric shade which blocks out the sun during the day. It also has a slider across that you can connect the screen to. You could have the screen side for opening that moon roof during the day or in the evening. You could also unlatch the screen and just leave it in the open position as you can see here. If you want to open this skylight, all you do is simply pull that crank lever down and crank it up and you can fully open get great ventilation through the bedroom area of your camper. You can also access the roof going up through this skylight put your patio chairs and set up here to watch air shows to the driver's side as you're in the bedroom you're looking at the TV mounting area it's a 19 inch LCD TV 12 volts you can use it without having to use 110 power as you can see here, it's triple pivot. You can easily angle it for the bedroom viewing. And then it's completely reversible for dinette viewing. Seeing it from the bedroom side here. You also notice the connections, which is HDMI and 12 volt power connections. If you order 
the 89RB without a TV, this would be your mounting location and your connections for it. As we step back out of the bedroom, and then you see on the driver's side, the large galley on the 89RB, the nice open window in the galley, and you see the nice open counter space. The 89RB and all adventure models for that matter come with stainless steel sinks. This is the deep double bowl on this model with the nickel plated high rise faucet. Up above your galley is your optional stainless steel microwave and your designer accent panel inserts for your overhead storage. There's very nice storage up here. You open these cabinets. You can see the bulk storage area and the additional half shelf in the back giving you additional storage for those smaller items up out of the way and still storage for the larger items down below. One of the features that Adventure puts on all their models is the bullnose grabber catches for the upper doors giving you a solid positive latching keeping the door closed. As we move to the rear of the galley section you see the new for 2020 Dometic range oven and the new cast iron grate cooktop which as you can see here easily allows you to put the pans in any position and not stuck on those little single burners. Also eliminates the overhead cooktop cover still gives you the use of this space with the cast iron grate and you can see the matching stainless steel backsplash above the oven is the new Furion cooktop exhaust fan this is a nice new look for 2020 and a new item you can see the larger exhaust fan underneath and the nice LED light with the simple controls On the rear of the galley section on the wall, which is actually the front of your wet bath, this particular model this has the solar option. So you can see this is where your solar panel controller will be mounted. You can see it working here and showing its charge effect for today. And below that is your service center, controlling your hot water heater, water pump, your entry light, and your outside porch light. Controls for your battery level, fresh water, black, gray, all controlled right there. In the rear vent opening is standard the 10 blade fantastic fan with three speed control. You open your front windows or your Heinz moonroof and open this fan and turn it on you get great cross ventilation. The fantastic fan really replaces air conditioning up to about 80 degrees. As we go below the galley countertop area you see the large oven and you see an ample amount of drawers. One that's down below the oven right here. It's a good place to store your cutting board sink top covers and also a deep drawer for storage pots and pans. To the front of the cooktop in the oven is a bank of three drawers for nice additional storage. As you can see here, solid wood drawers, ball bearing metal guides on the side, full extension drawers so you can access the whole drawer, and on all Adventure products is the soft self-closing drawer guides that close themselves and latch to the nice magnetic catches. Below the galley sink is a large storage area. Opens up with large access for storage, large items, pots and pans, or even a garbage can if that's what you want to store in this area. As we move down the rear, on the inside of the driver's side of the camper, you can see the radius wall wet bath on this model. This radius wall makes a big difference in the feel of the inside room on this truck camper. A lot of people feel this truck camper 
has slides, we'll see them at shows coming out, looking out the rear door, wondering which side the slide is on. This is a very roomy truck camper. Let's take a look at this largest wet bath in the industry. First thing you'll notice is the large sliding door, so it's easy to access and get into. Door simply, simply slides open. First thing you notice is how bright it is in here because of the full roof skylight giving you all that additional lighting and additional 8 inches of headroom in the shower so taller folks can enjoy this shower too. You notice the large open shower space floor, the toilet foot flush design so it's easier to flush. As we move up you see the dry TP holder keeping your TP dry. And we come up to the molded built-in bath sink and as we go higher forward you see the mirrored medicine cabinet. It really has quite a bit of storage in it. As we move around to the driver's side of the wet bath you see the Adventure exclusive side power vent for your shower. Allows you to have that big skylight up above and still have venting through the sidewall. You notice the satin nickel shower head and double control faucets. Let's just do another view of the entire 89RB truck camper for 2020. It's the galley section, a large queen bedroom section, double door wardrobes, Seven cubic foot refrigerator with designer accent panels. Your large spacious dinette area. It makes into additional sleeping for two. Your overhead cabinet storage, your stereo system. You see your fantastic fan. Your rear entry door. And the large wet bath. As we take our final view from the rear of the truck camper forward, you notice the AC optional air conditioner is a 10,000 BTU air conditioner. This unit is pretty well loaded up and remember it also fits short bed and long bed trucks three quarter ton and larger. I want to remind all viewers that the Adventure product is built to the stringent RVIA code and that all Adventure products are four season Again, thank you for watching our video walk around. For more information, please visit our website at amlrv.com.